Hey guys, I'm Miguel Sanchez, and welcome to episode 398 of Logo History. Whew, what a day, my friends, what a day. Before we get started, though, no, again, no Moshi Sleep Through Righteous this week because the Wednesday events over here is a meditation. That's right, it's called, it's called, it's called Unicorn Sleep Meditation with Flutter Cup. And I'm going to tell you why. <sighs> That's right, my friends. New Moshi Meditation out now. So that means no sleep story this week. We'll get it. No, we'll, we'll do it next week. Just, uh, probably we'll get one in time for the Olympics. Maybe we'll have all the Moshi monsters return. But who knows? Um, new Moshi Meditation out now. Relax with Flutter Cup and her unicorn friends in this dreamy meditation that's designed to be used at bedtime. Sweet dreams are made of unicorn magic. Ugh. Boring. We'll see what the email has to say. New Moshi Meditation out now. Unicorn sleep meditation with Flutter Cup. Uh oh. That's what it's supposed to be. This week, little ones will love listening to this magical sleep meditation that has been created for bedtime, but it's perfect for any time. Featuring Flutter Cup, one of our most popular characters, and lots of her unicorn friends, we can't think of a, of a better way to help your kids drift into the sweetest of dreams. Ugh, listen now, I can't believe it guys, how could you? But but yes, we, uh, no, no, we heard Flutter Cup and Flutter Cup School for Unicorns, and now we finally get to see Flutter Cup for the first time ever in her true body. Yeah, her true form. Ugh, Flutter Cup. Who doesn't say about that? But yes, go to... Uh, 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 yeah, have, let's do it. Please go check it out. By the way, uh, Flutter Cup was featured in episode 25 of Moshi Sleep Story Reactions. During Flutter Cup's School for Unicorns. So you haven't seen it yet. Watch it right now. So thank you for your attention. You have been warned. Thanks so much. We'll, we'll try again next week. But, uh, but, but uh, we'll do a more great Moshi content for you, including Moshi Wants to Buy Me, where we have a new one for you today. It'll be about Weenie, the teeny genie, coming out of the kitty set. So be able to look up for that. I mean, I mean, on uh, the naughty set. So be able to look up for that as well. For now, though, let's get ready for today's episode. You guys ready for it? Oh, oh yes. It's on, my friends. It's on. You ready? Good. Then let's begin. So, yes, look to episode 388. It's about Facebook and Twitter. Whew. Man, what a day. I gotta say, it's absolutely anything but ordinary. But we're gonna get to it right now. I have my own Facebook and Twitter accounts. My, my Facebook account is just because Sanchez. My Twitter account is at because Sanchez 58. Links to both are in the about page of my main channel. So please go to it right now. And for those who have seen the episode 397, it was uploaded earlier today. We took a look at Culver's. Serving frozen cutter and butter burgers straight out of Wisconsin. So watch it now. The link is on the top right corner of the screen. So please go check out the video. In the meantime, let's. Jump right into it, and shall we begin? Yes, we can. Here we go. But first, images are taken from the Wikipedia. Quick, goes to everyone. All these images are brought to me. Nor to anybody else. So keep that in mind as we go through. Again, all images are taken from the Wikipedia, and the credit goes to everyone. Now, without any further delay, let's begin. First, let's take a look at Facebook. Here's a drop off for those of you who don't, who don't know what Facebook is. Facebook is an American online social media and social networking service owned by Facebook Incorporated. Founded in 2004 by Mark Zuckerberg, with fellow Harvard College students and roommates Eduardo Savarin. Andrew McConnell, Dustin, the, the, the Muscovitz, and Chris Hughes. Its name comes from the Facebook directories, often given to American university students. Membership was initially limited to Harper students, gradually expanding to other North American universities, and, since 2006, anyone over 13 years old. As of 2020, Facebook claimed 2.8 billion monthly active users and ranked seventh in global internet usage. It was the most downloaded mobile app of the 2010s. Oh my gosh. Facebook can be accessed from devices with internet connectivity, such as personal computers, tablets, and smartphones. As registering, users can create a profile revealing information about themselves. They can post text, photos, and multimedia, which are shared. They can post text, photos, and multimedia, which are shared with any other, with any other users who have agreed to be their friend or with different privacy settings publicly. Users can also communicate directly with each other with Facebook Messenger, join common inter interest groups, and receive notifications on the activities of their Facebook friends and pages they follow. The subject of, the, the su the subject, the subject of numerous controversies, Facebook has often criticized over issues such as user privacy, as with the Cambridge Analytica data scandal. Political manipulation, as with the 2016 U.S. elections, mass surveillance, uh, the psychological effects such as additional, uh, such as addiction and low self-esteem, and contexts and contexts such as fake news, conspiracy theories, copyright infringement, and hate speech. Comment, uh, commentators have accused Facebook of willingly facilitating 
They're going to facilitate the spread of such content, as well as exaggerating its number of users to appeal to advertisers. Whew, that was a whole lot, but yeah, we got stats here. Service name is Facebook. Type of service is social network, networking service. And publisher found on February 4, 2004. Owners Facebook Incorporated. Headquarters are in Menlo Park, California, U.S. Their slogan is Board Together. That's right, their official slogan at the time. Website is www.facebook.com. Link is in the description below. Go there right now. You'll be glad today. And for now, let's begin the local history of Facebook. 2003, 2004, the website, the service was launched as Face Bash. So we just have to Face Bash in white text on a dark red background. So yeah, that's it, my friends. 2004, 2005, they changed the A to the Facebook. Yeah, so we have here, so we have here two light blue parentheses. Yes, I'm sure the, there's a the word, the Facebook in light blue text. And the whole logo is on a blue background. So yeah, that's it. Everything you need to know. 2005, 2015, they finally changed the A to Facebook. So here we have a blue rounded rectangle inside this where Facebook in white text. So yeah, that's everything you need to know. I don't know, but yeah, that's okay. Here's the print version, the inverted version, the icon from, 2000 to, uh, from 2005 to 2012. Yes, I love it. Uh, no, from 2005 to 2010. Sorry, people. We have the icon from 2010 to 2012 and the icon from 2012 to 2013. So yeah. Whew. So yeah, that's it. So yeah, that's everything you need to know. Oh yeah. By the way, uh, wrong note here. That last icon, it was actually from 2009 to 2013. From 2009 to 2012. So... You got it right? Let me know, let me know in the comments. Yeah, uh, 2015, 2020, same as before, except the font changed and the background and the red tiger isn't routed anymore. So yeah, that's it. Here's the print version, the inverted version, the and the icon used from 2013 until 2020. So yeah, that's it. And finally, just wait to the present, the red tiger is removed and the text is now in blue text. So yeah, that's it. Here's the icon and the 2D version of the icon. Moving on, let's close out this episode with Twitter. And here's the show bio for those of you who don't know what Twitter is. Twitter is an American microblogging and social networking service well, on which users post and interact with messages known as tweets. Registers use registered users can post, like, and retweet tw tweets, but unregistered users can only read them. Re re users access Twitter through its website interface or its mobile data application software or app. Through phone, the service could also be be accessed via SMS before April 2020. The service is provided by Twitter Incorporated, a incorporation based in San Francisco, California has more than 25 offices around the world. Tweets were originally restricted to 140 characters, but the limit was doubled to 280 for non-CJK languages in November 2017. Audio and video tweets remain limited to 140 seconds for most accounts. Oof, oh my gosh, I know. And by CJK, it stands for Chinese, Japanese, Korean. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of fun. Uh, Twitter was created by Jack Dorsey, Noah, Noah Glass, Biz Stone and Evan Williams in March 2006 and launched in July of that year. By 2012, more than 100 million users were posted 340 million tweets a day. And the service handled an average of 1.6 billion search queries per day. In 2013, it was, it was one of the 10 most visited websites and has been described as the SMS of the internet. As of Q1, quarter one of 2019, Twitter add more than what more than 330 billion monthly million 300 billion monthly active users. Twitter is as some too many microblogging is a some too many microblogging service, given that the vast majority of tweets are written by a small minority of users. <laughs> Whew, and that's all there is to us. We want stats here. Service day of Twitter industry is news, social networking service provided on March 21st, 2006. Their founders are Jack Dorsey, Thor Glass. This stone Evan Williams, the fight is on my Twitter incorporated. Headquarters are in San Francisco, California, United States. They don't have a slogan. Website www.twitter.com. Link is in the description below. Go check it out right, go check it out right now. And once you're there, you can find and once you're there, you can find me at Miguel Sanchez58. But yes, without further ado, let's get started with the final logo of the day. The logo is up Twitter. 2006, we have a personal logo as Twitter, but this time it's spelled T-W-T-T-R. Yeah, so we have the word so we have the word T-W-T-T-R in green text. In green text, except the letter W is a light green text, and coming out of the letter R, there's a and coming out of red, there's a green splops out there. Yeah, yeah, the T W, yeah, that, yeah, the text is a slimy text, the slimy green text. Ugh. Yeah, and the whole logo is on the white background. So yeah, Twitter. <laughs> yeah, I love it. Uh, 2006, 2010, let's invite you into Twitter. Yeah, spell T W I T T E R. So, so we just have the word Twitter and uh, we just have the word Twitter in light blue text on a white. Outline, and that's it. Um, here's the print version and the icon. And we have the and we also have the Twitter words. One from 2006, one from 2007, and the other from and one from 2009. All day, Larry the Bird, and they're all on the white background. So yeah, now you know. 2010, 2012, the outline is the outline of the text is removed. The font of the text is slightly changed. 
Yes, and yes, the font size has slightly changed, and now in the writing of the text, there's a light blue silhouette of a bird. Whew, the Twitter bird, to be said. So yeah, night out. Here's the print version, the bird, and the print version of the bird. And finally, just to the present, the, uh, and finally, uh, the text has been removed, and the bird is slightly modified, and that looks different, and the, the, uh, yeah, the, and the color, and the shade of light blue is now a little bit darker. So yeah, that's everything you need to know. Here's the print version, and yeah, by God. That's it, guys. We're done. Thank you for watching an episode of Logo History. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Only two episodes left this season. And then we're done for season four. So, so and then Logo History Moshi will take over for season for season two later on. Yes. It's going to happen next week, my friends. Logo History, two, Logo History Moshi will return for season two, two next week. So, my friends, so don't miss it. For now, please remember to leave like, share with your friends. Leave a comment below. Please don't forget to subscribe with notifications. Don't miss a new video for me as we're on the road to 1,100 survivors. But yes, that's it, guys. Thank you all for watching today. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Links to both are in the uh, are, are the about page of the main channel. And that's it, guys. I'm your guys. That's it. Your result. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you tomorrow on Logo History. Oh my gosh! And it comes down to it's the second to last episode of the season. Episode 399 is about Fujitsu, straight out of Japan. So don't miss it, my friends. We are in it to win. So get ready, guys. <sighs> One of the biggest things in Japan, Fujitsu. That, will, that we will talk about on the next episode. So we will see you tomorrow for episode 399. Taking a look at Fujitsu. But we'll see on Motion Monster Party later on today. If we take a look at Weenie, the teeny genie from the naughty set. Until then, I'm your guys. I'm for Logo History. Until tomorrow, my friends. Thanks for watching. Like, favorite, subscribe. I'll see you in another video. Laters!